Now, a lot of you have asked for a packing video for Alaska, and I didn't make one before the trip because we ran out of time and I was tired, but I did want to show you what and how I packed, so stay tuned for a demonstration of what I used. Now, first thing to keep in mind is that we only have one large suitcase, and that is used for Cullen. I have two carry-on sized suitcases that I checked one and I carried on the other. I do not recommend that. I recommend one large suitcase if you need it, um, just because it's a little more stressful this way. Okay, so I use a couple different methods for packing. First of all, I have packing cubes. And you've seen me use these before. These packing cubes are from Trip Travel Gear. They are compression, fully compression packing cubes. So that means they can expand to whatever I need. And if I don't need all that space or I need a smaller space, I just compress. Super neat. My socks, underwear, bras, all that kind of stuff goes in these packing cubes. Second kind of packing cubes I have are the newer ones from Trip Travel Gear. These are also compression, but they are a bit larger. So I have, in this one, I've rolled up leggings and jeans. So I can fit one, two, three, four, five, six, like 11, 12 pairs of pants in one packing cube. Super great. There's the opening, and then if I need more, It opens on both sides. Ta -da! So I have two of those. One has shirts, one has pants. Like I said, socks and underwear. Now, for Alaska, guys, it is cold and you need layers. So the only issue is that all this stuff takes up a lot of room. Boom, baby! Vacuum seal bags. Total lifesaver. I've packed so many sweaters in these bags. Um, I think you can buy them at w Walmart probably. I got mine at Target for $20 for five bags. You don't need an actual vacuum. You can roll it up. I sit on them. Um, but look how cute this is. Just, just, look, just look. First of all, look how neat. I can pack stuff like this in a carry-on bag. Isn't that neat? Isn't that neat? Okay. And then last but not least, I have um, my swimsuits in this wet bag. I have like five or six swimsuits in there. And then my dresses I have rolled up in my suitcase like normal. Let me show you that. Oh, that's not my dresses. That's more sweaters and a hat and more hat and hat. My dresses must be over here. Let me show you my dresses. Well, boom. Dresses and what's underneath? More sweaters. How did you pack? Oh, um, I actually got help from you this time. That's accurate. Which is super cool because it was very helpful. But the trip travel gear bags right here not spawns but check these out they open like so and they do loosen up but i like how durable they are and i put some workout clothes some socks and underwear in this one and then Alyssa put pants and like a sweater in here two sweaters pants and i really appreciate it so i'm already almost done actually here are my suit coats and she's not wrong these little what compression bags you used Mm -hmm. You didn't even have to like get a vacuum, did you? Mm -mm, I sat no. on them. Yeah, you sat on them and they like reverse seal and it got really, really small. So like, for example, like, whoops, almost dropped all my clothes out of there. One cube, and here's one of their older cubes. And I put all my swim trunks and stuff in there because they're like water resistant and everything. And then another packing thing. And if you check in here, it's actually uh, a lot more organized than what you may have expected from the Carnival Panorama series. So, uh, I definitely recommend this and the packing cubes, for sure. 
For I'm, show. I'm so proud. <laughs> He's learned something from packing. I'm going to unpack and then I will show you specifically like the sweaters and kind of stuff that I got because I know if you've made it this far in the video and you're thinking that it's the end and then you're really sad because you didn't actually see what I packed. I know you people. I know you'd be like, you didn't show what you packed. I'll show you. Just get, give me a couple minutes. I'll finish. Okay. So obviously you will see these outfits as we go along with the vlogs, but I do want to at least highlight the kinds of outfits that I brought. So in here I have one, two, three, four, five, six dresses. Technically five dresses and this is a skirt with some long sleeves trying to stay warm. This has a shawl and then over in this closet, here are all of my sweaters. As you can see, I love neutral colors. Lots of gray, pink, light green. This is what will keep me warm. Um, I left all of my packing cubes intact, mainly because there aren't any drawers. So as you can see here, it's all shelving. This just kind of keeps my things a little more organized. So we have pants in here, we have tops um, and sports bras and stuff in there. And at the bottom, we have my shoes. Now, I only packed two pairs of shoes for dinner. Sandals and these boots. So if an outfit didn't look good with either of those, I didn't bring it because packing was very limited. Thumbs up. Also, I packed plenty of beanies and scarves and I went out and I bought some warmer socks because I don't have a lot. So there's that. And I have one more thing. You want to see what it is? You want to see what the last thing is? Um, yes, absolutely. Great. So this was my personal item, technically my carry on. So we have the trip travel gear backpack, which is great for excursions. You can fold it into itself if you're not using it, but I used it to bring more things. So in here I had my shoes, but also my toiletries. This is a quart size bag. It holds all of my bottles. These are shampoo, not shampoo, I don't use shampoo. Um, conditioner, body wash, stuff for my hair, all that stuff in this bag. And then this one, yep, there's a hook. That means it hangs. Ta-da! <laughs> there are three compartments up here. Cotton balls, Q-tips. In here I have my razor, my toothbrush, my toothpaste. And then I use this compartment for my hair mask. Anything that I think is going to get a little messy because there's a cleaner in here. So this is also um, a trip to travel gear piece, that and this. Super helpful for efficient packing. Also, um, if you guys watched the Aruba series when we were, what? Also, guys, if you watched the Aruba series and the Curacao series, we had a purple trip travel gear backpack, which we went horseback riding and rappelled off a mountain, which is super cool. But we actually have a blue one at home that I think we should just give away. I think we should. I think we should. We so, also, though, have one of these. Ooh. One of these toiletry oh, to bags. Oh, to give away. To give away. Tell you what, guys. Yeah, this one's mine. You can't have that. Click the link in the description box below. Um, to go grab you one, but just leave a thumbs up on this video and maybe we will just choose one lucky person who wrote a comment in the section below and uh, we'll give away a bag. So that is what I packed for this Alaskan cruise. Will I be warm enough? I don't know, but I'm definitely proud of how efficient I was able to pack in two carry-ons and not having to get a bigger suitcase. So let us know in the comments what you pack or what you would pack for an Alaskan cruise because I want to hear from you.